Hello, hello again and welcome Sterling C Sample here from the Steel Jump Training Center of America. Today we're going to go into another tutorial on navigating the tenor pan, specifically the fourth and fifth tenor pan. Okay, guys, so we're going to find the melody today. I'll show you how to find the melody of the song and um, how to find the, you know, get into the juice of the song. The melody is, is very important, so we're going, to, we're going to work on melody today. Let me bring the screen a little bit. So, what we do, we have some preset MIDI's here. What I have, this is MIDI player. MIDI player loads MIDI from, from your computer. Okay, from, from your computer. Um, preset MIDI, these are MIDI that I put inside the system where you don't need to go online to find them. You can find them right inside the system. You don't need an online present to find them. Uh, so you're in, you're in the forest somewhere, in the bush somewhere, you can... <laughs> access these MIDI files here right here in the computer okay um and we already preloaded a song called silent night inside here okay over on this side here we have all you see all these color schemes here all these colors is the arming notes these are armed notes arm arm instruments these are all arm instruments one is white two is red three is green is green four is blue um, five is a, there's a kind of orange movies kind of stuff there. Uh, six is a light blue. Seven is a yellow. Eight is black, and then back to white because we have eight in all. Remember number ten, you do not arm ten. You leave ten alone. All these rest here, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. These are like for classical music when they have like more than uh, multiple instruments in the band, multiple instruments. Now, when we start to play, song start to play, these little, little blue lights here are going to start to light up. Right, that's my phone making noise. These blue lights are going to start to light up. And once these blue lights start to light up, it means that there's a signal there. It means that the, 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 the system is receiving a MIDI signal. Okay, all these MIDI signals coming through here. So what we're going to do is um, start to play it. We have a song preloaded already. Right, so we're gonna start a play silent night. So number two. So we see the melody on blue, and we see the melody on yellow. Blue is four, and yellow is seven. So we have determined that the melody is on, and for this particular song, is on four and seven. The melody and harmony is on four and seven. Right, so let's, let's go ahead. We're going to make this video real short and sweet okay guys real short and sweet so we're going to stop it and we're going to disarm all of these here disarm number one disarm number two disarm number three leave number four number four is where the melody at disarm number five disarm number six seven is one the melody at disarm number eight disarm number nine so we have two two um two bytes one on four and one on seven those were the harmony and melody is. so let's go with that let's go with that let's go with that and watch it work
there you go that's the melody that's the melody right there so let's play it one more time one more time so you get it remember you could slow it down if it's too fast for you slow it down one more time Remember your melody is on four on seven, okay? All right. There you go. So, no matter what standard you are, how far you are, into, into playing pan this is going to help you okay guys it's going to help you a lot to learn songs as fast as you can and it's going to help the beginners to learn songs as fast as as, as slow as you want to slow as slow as you want to do with it okay professional as fast as you want be, be, beginners as slow as you want okay take your time this is your oh you will you are your only tutor so this is the melody how you find melody for the tenor pan we're going to come into another class we're going to do um Double seconds, we're gonna do the guitar scores, we're gonna do the bass parts, how to find the bass parts, how to find bass, how to find guitars, how to find uh, the quadro parts or the double second parts in between. Okay, guys, so I'll see you in the other class. Sterling C sample here from the Steve Jump Training Center of America saying God bless you and talk soon.